Can you smell what these jars are spelling? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Tickets to our live shows in Houston, New Orleans, Birmingham, Jacksonville, and Tampa in early September are on sale now. So go to redlinklive.com now for tickets and VIP meet and greets today, now. At the end of this month is the Scripps National Spelling Bee, and if you can spell Esquamulos, you might be a spelling bee kid. Definition, please. I do not have one. But if you know what bird crap smells like, yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> then you might be a smelling bee kid, and that's all that matters today. It's time for... The, the second, second Annual Burbank, Burbank Invitational Smelling Bee. bee. <laughs> Welcome to the Smelling Zone. And just like last time, we're gonna each take turns at the stench bench smelling the smells before us. When we smell a smell correctly, the first letter of that smell will show up on the board. And that mystery word over there on the board represents yet another completely different smelly substance. And a bucket full of that nasty stuff is gonna be dumped on somebody, either the smeller if he guesses wrong, or the other guy if he guesses right. Mm-hmm, and Lil Stinker, the smelling BB, is gonna do the dumping. Hello, Lil Stinker. Hey, it's great to be here. <laughs> <laughs> is all of your banter gonna be... Pun related? Pun related. Probably. Okay. Probably. <laughs> no, it didn't work, I don't know. <laughs> All right, Listen. Rhett, you go first. All right. All right, contestant number one, smell your first smell. Oh yeah, get those nostrils down on it. Oh, it's a, it's a vegetable. It's a fermented vegetable. That is sauerkraut. That's your final answer? I feel very confident about that. That is correct. Woo! And it starts with an S. You're off to a good start. A four letter word that starts with an S? <laughs> that, I don't want <laughs> that I don't want dumped on me? Oh! You getting something stinky? Oh! That is, that could be a lot, it could be a lot of different things. What, what, what are you experiencing? Give us something. It smells like it could be in like the cheese family, like it's a really, like it's a stinky cheese. Okay. I had a family. You guys took me away from them. <laughs> we'll put you back. I'm, I, I'm sorry about that. It's okay. We're going extinct. Was it, is it hive collapse syndrome? Is that what took you from your family? No, it was a literal hand that came in, grabbed me, and oh. then put me here, but it's okay. I'm union now. <laughs> I don't feel confident about this guess, but I'm gonna say cheese. No, cheese is incorrect. Okay, here we go. Oh, that is uh, like a, it, we're in like a soap or deodorant. Um, Need an answer. I'm gonna go with deodorant? That is incorrect. I'm not doing well. Believe oh. in yourself. <laughs> uh, this is fruity. Uh, it's like, it smells like Kool-Aid. You believe that it's a beverage? I will say you're correct. It smells like sweet tart drink. So I guess I could say energy drink, but I could also say Red Bull. Need a final answer. It's an energy drink. Ener it's an energy drink. We need more specific. You got I gotta be that specific? Yes. Monster. No. Oh, yes, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! All right, yes. move on over to the solving pool. Very nice. And Rhett, you got, you got you got an S and an M to go to go on. The, okay. My um, microphone's a little short. That's all I gotta say. If you get this correct, I uh, get whatever it is dumped on me. Some scam. I'm gonna dump a scam on you. Spam. Spam. Spell it. S P A M. Spam. That's correct. <laughs> Yes, it is. Are we gonna get to see Link get dumped with that? Yep. Will you hold my glasses? Don't touch the glasses part. Any last words? Do your best, B. You ain't my keeper. <laughs> oh! Scam? Okay, Link. You've got four substances in front of you. You have a substance on your shoulders that you're probably still smelling. I, all I can smell is spam. This smells better. Oh, I've smelled this before. Uh, this is tea. You are correct, but you need to be more specific. What See, type of tea is it? Lipton. 
No, no, no. It starts with a... No, what flavor of tea is it? Earl Grey tea. Yes! That is correct. Yeah, I got an E! Oh, this is fish. <laughs> I smell nothing but fish. Okay, well. Is that Does it answer? have legs? I'm not gonna answer that question. All I can smell is fish. Okay, wrong. <laughs> uh, that second one's tricky, isn't it? <laughs> That's a tricky spot. It smells fruity. Uh-huh. Oh, this is a drink. This is that red drink. Oh gosh, Hawaiian punch. It's another kind of drink. It's not Hawaiian punch, I'll give you one more chance. It smells exactly like Hawaiian punch. Cherry Coke. That's I Root you, beer. I give you, no, okay, okay, you gotta move on now. I gave you, I gave you three guesses. Oh gosh. <laughs> this is like a dirty sock. We're gonna give it to you as socks. Socks, yes. Yeah. Okay, okay. Link. Step e. into, step into the guessing pool. E space space S. <laughs> Is it, it could be eels. <laughs> <sighs> We're going to need a final answer. Elfs. All I can think of is eels. Ears. Okay, like Ears. Is that your final answer? Yeah, ears. E A R S. Wrong, Link. It's eggs. Eggs. <laughs> Dang it! I should have known it was eggs. <laughs> Assume the position. Oh. Oh. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> oh. Oh, I shouldn't have took my glasses off. Oh, oh, oh. look at that, you got egg in the left <laughs> eye. Oh. Yeah. All right, Red, get to smelling. This smells like stinky cheese again. It smells like cheese. Okay, I would be more prone to help you out, but I'm coated in yep. egg and spam. Okay, I'm gonna say cheese. Nope, it's not. Oh, that's a tough one. Did not have the first letter. The first letter is very helpful. Oh, that's a, that's a, that's a vegetable. This is so difficult. I'm also sp smelling the, there's little pieces of Spam that you dropped over here. <laughs> yeah, there's, uh, there's more pieces over here. Oh, what is that? That's a, that's a Thanksgiving dinner. Final answer? Yes. Nope. <laughs> not it. I miss the outside. <laughs> we'll let you out soon enough. It's not something that's in a Thanksgiving dinner? Dang it. I'm not gonna get any of these. Mm. That's a soap of some kind. Nope. It's it's a fragrance like it's in it's in the it's just like last time it's in like the soapy deodorant aftershave category. I'll give you you're not getting any right, so I'll give you a this is this would be in school. It'd be in school. School. It's okay to be wrong. No, it's not because I get it dumped on me. That was a hint. Oh, eraser. Final answer. Yeah. That's correct. <laughs> okay, I you got, got one. an E. I got one. I got one. That's not helpful. Brace yourself. Man, I think this is something that's gone bad. But I kind of like it. it. Smells like old bread. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go with that. Old bread or slash mold. It is bread. Be more specific. Like a type of bread? Like focaccia? <laughs> Not that specific. <laughs> For what? Focaccia. I need a final answer. It's a form of bread. It's a pizza crust, I don't know. No, you didn't get it. Move on over Man, to the is? guessing zone. And now for this last round, you have an opportunity to ask for a lifeline, and that can be the origin or for it to be used in a sentence. I suggest you use one of those. Proctor, I would like the origin of this smell. Okay, origin. This word originates from Google autofill when you type in any woman's name. What? <laughs> you type in any woman's name. Yeah, it originates from Google autofill. That's the origin. When you type in any woman's name. Is that a joke? I wish it were. So if you put Sheila, space, this is the next thing? Yeah, that's the, that's the world that we live in now. <laughs> There's, I have, I literally have nothing. Well, what, what words fit with that? Just sound it out. Beam. <laughs> <laughs> um, 
Uh, beef. Sheila Beef. <laughs> uh, someone tells me that's not right? You're, you're on the right track from a spelling standpoint. Oh, it's two, it's two E's. Or is it? Uh, beef, that's all I got. Sheila Beef. All right, the correct answer is feet. Mm. Sheila's feet. Oh, Sheila's feet. Got it. Foot Sheila. fetish. Oh. All right, you might have to take a knee. Okay, ready? Here we go. <laughs> Sorry, oh, I gotta gosh. get it. It's a it's lot heavy. of water. <laughs> oh! 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 It's pickle pig's feet. <laughs> and, uh. uh. and the bee missed the bowl. Uh. It's well. all under our fireplace. Uh. Uh. Pickle pig's feet. Uh. <laughs> Okay, Link, all I can smell is vinegar, but you've got four things to smell in front of yourself. Ah, uh, this one's mild. <laughs> oh, come on, Linkster. Come on. You can do it. I just feel like I'm toking it so hard. Getting not much. <laughs> uh, Cheerios. Not even close. Not even close. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I've smelled this before. This is strong. This is pungent. Okay, yep. It's, uh, is it fishy? I feel like it's fishy. What, what, what do you smell like it's? This is definitely fish. This is like a. Okay, it is fish. I'm gonna I need, need to be more to be specific. specific. Uh, we have had this on the show. It's not so strumming because that's way too strong. Um, it's a type of fish and I believe that sir strumming may be based on this type of fish. That's, that's about as far as I can go. Uh, sardines. So close, but no, what's the other thing that's like a sardine? Tuna. <laughs> no. Ah. Uh, All right, moving on. Seriously, I got a rally, man. I believe in you on this one. Ugh. <laughs> this is pungent. Yep. This is cleaner. I do think that you uh, can use this as cleaner. Ah. Uh, you can use it as cleaner, but it's not. It's not a name brand cleaner. I think you need to sniff really hard to get the guess <laughs> right. Yeah. I just killed brain cells at this point. I can feel myself getting stupider. You have not only smelled this on this show. I know that show, feeling. Not only smelled this on this show, you've drank this on this show. Did you pee in this? It is urine. <laughs> Correct, is, Link, it's urine. urine. You! Yes, you got the vowel. Who That's very it? important. Lucas. Lucas. Do you have any medical advice for Lucas? <laughs> after, <laughs> after smelling his urine that hard? Yeah, you should use it to clean. <laughs> ooh. Ravioli. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You're in the right family. This is so much, this is marinara sauce. It <laughs> has marinara sauce on it, but what is it? Meatballs. That's correct, man. Yeah. Yeah. Um, All right, you've got the last two um, letters. Come over here. All right. And see if you can get it. Watch your step. Oh, gosh. That's a nice splash. Um. May I hear the word in a sentence? Yes, you may. We grew up together. He's my best blank. Plum. Chum. Ch is that chum is the stinky stuff that you put in the water for sharks to come up? My answer is chum. C H U M. Chum. Yes. No, you're right, you jerk. <laughs> Uh, you didn't think I would know what the word chum. No, I knew as soon as you got U-M and as soon as you were going to get a clue, you'd put it together. All okay. right, B. Go for it. Oh, Just what gosh. the doctor ordered. Oh! Oh, no! Oh, gosh. Oh, thanks, chum. Imagine if they did this in the real spelling bee. I don't think there are any winners here. Go free, B, or sting somebody. Make honey. That's, is, that's, that's a fake. This call. is a lie! Yeah. <laughs> Go out through the door. Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. I'm Una Van Weinsberg, and I'm in Washington, D.C. at the Scripps National Spelling Bee, and it's time to spin the wheel of the cat body. Oh, that looks like fun. F-U-N, fun. Click the top link to watch us play Slang Man and Good Mythical More. And to find out where the Wheel of Mythicality is gonna land. Get a grip on your phone. Mythical and GMM Pop Sockets available now at mythical.store.